Do you like anime? Do you like Japanese inspired things? Do you like clothes? I'm sure you like to stay warm. Well, I got this stuff for you. Introducing Imori.com, a website that introduces anime and Japanese inspired styled clothing made in house. And you can use the code Uchi15 to save yourself 15% off of all these cool, dope hats, beanies, hoodies, t shirts, sweatpants, and way more where that came from. That's Uchi15 at checkout to save yourself 15% off your entire order at Imori.com. What's up, everybody? <gasps> it's your boy Uchi. And, uh, back again. Once again, how y'all doing today? And we got episode three, the correct door of Tower of God. So yes, uh, this video is a little late, probably like a day late because uh, if you didn't already know, I've been no life in Final Fantasy VII Remake. And yes, I finally completed it. I finally finished the main story. I got like 51% of the trophies. So I was like, oh wow, I got half of the trophies. That's pretty dope. So that's why this video was delayed. If you're watching this, you know, obviously like, you know, the day after the release, normally I do release the reactions the same day. For those that are wondering why I was not there. But as far as the reactions are doing the reactions are doing fairly well i'm hitting over 100 likes so definitely continue those likes guys keep make sure you keep liking the videos because that way more people can see them and we are going along with youtube's algorithm the goal is still going to be 200 likes this is a pretty healthy goal to have and like i keep saying we're pretty much staying consistent with getting over 100 so that's a really good thing this episode i feel like we're gonna have a little bit more action as far as my predictions go i haven't been able to catch up with the manhwa just yet from where i left off so i'm still on like chapter like four or something like that but the last episode we saw there was a little bit of dialogue going a lot more dialogue going on than action kind of more story elements to you know kind of build up the scenarios and the characters and a lot of you in the comments were actually telling me that i was very very scary with how close my predictions are so we'll see what happens with bam and the rest of the cast so with all that being said guys why don't we just get right Do you like Attack on Titan, Dragon Ball Super, Dr. Stone, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood? Well, those are just a few of the several different hundreds of anime selections that you can watch for free with my trial code for Funimation Now. All you gotta do is click that link in the description below and check out Funimation Now for a free 14-day trial period to enjoy all of these anime and many, many more. That's Funimation Now by using the link in the description below. <laughs> Ooh, backstory. Okay. Was he exiled? Ooh, disgrace to the family. Sounds like an exile to me. Oh, no. He was used? Oh. That was his mom telling him. Close your heart. Close your eyes or ears. Damn. So don't feel. Don't see. Don't do nothing. <laughs> Yo, he's funny. Oh, snap. So stars and night skies don't exist in their world? Wow. <laughs> this guy looks really weird. Oh, he called him the abandoned son of the Kuhn family. Struck a nerve. Damn. Bro, he almost killed and popped this damn bag, whatever the hell it is. That was kind of scary. Oh, he's he's a, he was the guy from yesterday, last week's episode. He's the director of this particular test. They have to open the correct door. They got to do it in 10 minutes. Damn. They got like no clues either. He's he is now organizing his thoughts of the information. Yo, Rack is out of control right now. Damn. So now he's he's fighting with himself on what to believe. Does he believe the advice he was given as a youngin, or does he take the word of this dude that was just in his face, who knew who knows about his past? Damn, he's he, he's actually bugging out right now. Did he just did he just open the door? Maybe the answer of the test is just pick a door. Maybe the test is making a decision, and that's it. Instinct. Okay. Open a door within five minutes. I figured that. That makes sense. I thought he said pick a pick the right door. Nah, you know what? Now that I realize it, he did say... Actually, hold on. Let me, let me pay attention. Wow, the world won't wait for your certainty. Wow. This was a pretty cool episode. A lot of character realization and character depth. I like it. <laughs> this guy. That shit looks comfortable. Wow, he's mass smart. He figured it out. So that hint that that plastic bag guy made was a plant off the director to see if it would hinder them or help them. Whoa. Oh, snap. Who are those characters? They look dope. Oh, snap. That looked like a Pokemon badge. What? My man went money mode. 
and got a drink. <laughs> Call me the leader. <laughs> I like Rack. Rack is a pretty pretty cool character. He's funny and he's he's big and he thinks he's the smartest. He's just a funny guy. He's really cool. Bonus test. Oh, if they pass this bonus test, it counts as them passing all the tests. So they're gonna have they're gonna fail. Cause I already know that there's like 500 fucking chapters of this manhwa anyway. <laughs> Crown game. Stealing the crown from each other. Five teams will participate at once. Oh, yo, this is cool. It's like capture the flag, except it's capture the crown. They should just make a game for this mode right now then. Because I would like to play it. The game ends as soon as the person with the crown leaves the chair. Wow. Oh, those killer characters are in this shit. So there's, I think they said there's five rounds. So they're not participating in this one right now. So it looks like we're getting a little bit of action right as the episode is pretty much ending. Oh, 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 oh. Wow, she caught him just to throw him midair into the wall. She just busted his nose. Oh, oh, damn. Wow. She literally just got punched square in the head. She is literally bodying the whole team by herself. Wow, she made a whirlwind. Was that Rachel just now? Why is she wearing it though? Dude, that's Rachel. Damn, oh my God, this shit just got mad interesting. I knew it. Damn. Dope. So yes, what I was saying before was that I, I definitely liked that lesson or that, that test that they had about choosing the door because it even caught me off guard because I didn't realize that the director said to choose a door within the 10 minutes and like whatever. I thought that he said that choose the right door within 10 minutes and people that took more than five freaked out because they couldn't figure out how they could figure it out and that's and there was no clues or no no kind of directions as to how to figure it out i like that because at, after thinking about it myself like i was like you know what i bet you if they pick any door though it'll it'll be fine because it's the the test was about being quick on your feet and making a decision and you know just just going with it, you know? And, and and obviously being able to take the information that you get and rocking with it, you know what I'm saying? But I like how this episode ended though. This, this bonus test that's going on right now and the fact that Rachel's there, damn. I'm very, very excited for an episode four next week. All right, so there you go, episode three, the correct door reaction. I thought the episode was pretty solid. I was kind of wrong on this, uh, on the action packed part, but uh, a lot more story was involved, which I'm totally okay with. We got to learn more about Kuhn's backstory and see like where he came from. So he pretty much got exiled from his family. So that's kind of, that, I mean, that sucks, but it adds layers to his character. And we saw that actually it happened within the episode during that test and even before the test. So he, and he got provoked because that person knew of his past. So it kind of brought out another side of Kuhn. Um, and it, he's pretty much self-conflicted because he was told at a very young age to, you know, not really trust in anybody or anything like that. Whereas his lesson or his, his new question that he has to ask himself is like, when will he break that idea or not? So that's pretty cool. And then setting up for next week with this bonus test, I think this bonus test is kind of dope. I, like I said before, I already loved the lesson within that uh, making a decision test with the doors. I really like that a lot. But I'm 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 gonna I'm, I'm waiting to see how Bam's reaction is to Rachel next week and why she is also involved with all this. I mean, obviously she's trying to get up to the tower, so it would make sense for her to be involved in all this kind of stuff too. So we'll see what happens and we'll see what goes on. I feel like if it comes down to it, if she has to body him she's gonna do it and he's it's gonna catch him off guard too so who knows we'll see how this story envelops but guys let me know what you guys thought about it in the comments below like share subscribe hit me on twitter all that good stuff and uh let me know what you th thought of the episode and what you guys are looking forward to for next week and make sure to like the video most important thing make sure to like the video all the rest of the supporting links are also going to be in the description below make sure you guys are taking care of yourselves have a good one may the power protect you stay clean stay hot stay healthy stay inside and remember have yourself a good one. I'll see y'all next time.